Hi, I'm Bobby, and today I'm going to be doing my first reading vlog for this channel. It is Friday the 4th of September, and it's nearly half past eight. So I don't really have any plans for the weekend. I'm just, like, hoping to get a lot of reading done. So, hopefully. Hopefully. So the books I'm going to be reading this weekend, I've got three. But, um, like, only one of them was actually on my TBR. So, I mean... It is what it is, right? So I've got uh, one that was on the TBR, which was um, Stardust by Neil Gaiman. Um, I started this the other day. I got to page... Um, I think I got to page two. So I'm doing okay with this one. <laughs> so this one is, say, literally just under 200 pages. So that one shouldn't take me too long. Hopefully I'll read that one. I don't know how long that'll take me, but I can read it in a few hours if I wanted to. And then the other two... So the other book is a graphic novel and it's Morning Glories. This I've tried reading before. It's, um, so I think it's set in school. It's, I remember it being gory, but me, hang on. No, they're just, no, I'm sure there was a gory scene quite near the beginning. Huh, oh, that's gory. Yeah. Okay, so it's like, it's quite violent and gross and lots of murder and stuff. I don't really know the plot. I don't really remember anything about this, but I think I didn't get very far last time anyway, and that was a few years ago, so this one, I think it's going to be good. And of course, being a graphic novel, it will take me like a couple of hours to read. And then the one other book I've got to read is, um, it's a manga, and I'm only just getting into mangas recently. I've, I read one, I read, um, Death Note. And I read that one first because I'd seen the live action movie, so like, I sort of know the story anyway. And I read one my friend recommended. It's called Nyankees and it's about people who turn into cats, which sounds quite fun. Hang on, I've got a bookmark in here. I'm about um, that far through the book, so that's like nothing. But again, mangas aren't going to take that long for me to read, so in theory, I should be able to bash this one out quite fast. So um, those are my plans for this weekend and hopefully I'll actually get some reading done. Okay, so last night I only read about 10 pages of Stardust before I fell asleep. I was really tired last night, so yeah, I gave up. I don't think it helped that I was wrapped in a blanket and I was lying down and I was really comfy. Um, so <laughs> I'll try not to make that mistake again today. But um, I was about to start reading my graphic novel, so I'm going to start that now. And... It's okay, because today I've got myself some coffee, so... Okay, so it kind of looks like I haven't moved in hours and I kind of haven't. Okay, so I did read a little bit. I read some of the first issue of Morning Glories. So for those of you who know the story, they've just arrived at the school and then moving into the dorm room. That's about as far as I got. I haven't done much reading today. Um, it's, it's already eight o'clock on Saturday night and yeah, it's not going too well. Um, I don't tend to get too much reading done, to be honest. I mean, I have been doing coursework, like I've been studying today, so that took up some of my time. Although I left that to the last minute as well, so that's also not good. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to read a bit more of Stardust before bed. Hopefully I won't fall asleep reading it tonight. But yeah, I'm hoping to get, well, where was I? Ta page 10? Right, if I'm on page 10, and chapter 2 starts on page 
27. I could... I could read that much in like a little while, couldn't I? I could read that quickly, right? Okay, so it kind of looks like I haven't moved in the past few hours and I kind of haven't. Um, I did a little bit of reading. I read about half of the first issue of Morning Glories. So I haven't really done much. Don't even know how many pages that is. So I didn't get very far today. I read about 30 pages of Morning Glories issue 1. Um, for those of you who know the story, they've just arrived in the school and they're moving into the dormitories. Yeah, I, I'm quite enjoying it. I mean, it's a bit slow at the moment, but I think it's only the beginning, isn't it? It's um, the actual build up soon. Yeah, I like the I like this kind of story, like boarding school setting, mysterious teenagers. I think it's gonna be like really fun, really interesting. It's gonna be a good time. I just, you know, need to actually put some time into it. So it has now just gone 8 p.m. on Saturday night. I'm thinking that I'm going to start reading some more of Stardust, but I'm not sure. See if I can read it today without falling asleep. So I think I said earlier that I only got to page 10 of Stardust last night before falling asleep. I think that means I've got about another 15 or so pages before the end of the chapter. I'm not a fan of long chapters, that's going to, um, that's going to be a bit difficult. Hopefully I'll get quite a bit of reading done tonight and then I'll have better luck tomorrow maybe. But yeah, like I said, my evening was mostly taken up by doing coursework. I wasted most of my day today. I got up really early and then didn't achieve anything. So it was one of those weekend days, it's fine. We all have those. Okay, so it is now nearly 10pm and well, I didn't read any more of Stardust. But I did finish reading Morning Glories, so that's something. I think that's now the 31st book I've completed this year, so that's pretty good. And like my 5th or 6th graphic novel, and for someone who doesn't read graphic novels very much, that's quite good. So I'm pleased with myself for getting that done, at least. But I really do need to work on Stardust because it was the only one of these three books that was actually on my TBR for this month. Anyway, I'm gonna go to bed now. I'll speak to you in the morning. Maybe do more reading. Okay, so it's nearly 1 p.m. on Sunday afternoon. So when I signed off last night, I had every intention of just sitting down and reading Stardust. However, I went to put my camera battery on charge and I plugged it in and it went bang. So, got a deal of getting a new charger now. So I spent the whole night trying to talk to someone on Amazon about the, just, their stupid, just, just trying to get a refund and it was such a palaver and I didn't go to bed till midnight which is like, it's so late for me, like I usually go to bed between 9 and 10 p.m. so midnight is just horrible, horribly late. Which means that I only woke up about an hour ago. <sighs> I'm exhausted. I spent the whole morning sleeping and I don't feel like I had any sleep at all. And I haven't had any time to read because I spent the whole time dealing with Amazon and sleeping. So, I want to spend the afternoon reading. <sighs> so I want to spend the afternoon reading but I've also got coursework to do, and I was going to tidy, I was going to go out to the shops. <sighs> I don't know. I'm just... I'm going to try and fit some reading in. But, my goodness, I need to see some tidying in my room. It's going to be a busy afternoon. I've got a lot of coursework. Yeah, it's going to be a busy old afternoon. But, I might listen to an audiobook while I'm tidying. I've been listening to Gone Girl on Audible while I was, um, like I've been listening to it while I've been commuting to work, so I could listen to it a bit more now. Okay, so that's my plan for the afternoon. Reading, tidying, coursework. Right, time for a busy afternoon. I will check in with you guys soon. 
I'm going to try and sort myself out because I've had a really lazy Sunday so far. See you soon. Okay, so I spent literally 20 minutes tidying my room and it already feels so much better. Um, let me just give you a quick look. So, oh, this is Hugh Jackman. He lives with me now. Um, I used to have all my shoes on the floor down here and it's now all nice and clean. And they're all now tucked away behind my wardrobe. I hoovered everything. I feel so nice. I just need to do the desk later maybe. Um, I should probably do that before I start studying. But I am going to go out to the shops now. So... I will see you in a little bit. So in this clip I'm just doing a bit of studying. Um, I didn't really talk about my course much but I'm so I'm studying childcare. I'm doing my level three. It's basically the equivalent of an MVQ. So it's a vocational course and I'm learning like I'm training on the job. So I've been working in childcare for about a year and a half now and I've just started my qualification in the past month or two. So in this clip I'm just reading through some documents about health and safety. It's like pretty basic stuff that you know about like, you know, how to keep a building safe. Um, yeah, it's... It wasn't exciting, but it was like really necessary things to learn.
So in this clip I'm just going through my workbook about employment law. Um, one of the sections of this unit I have to basically study um, employment and responsibilities. It's not my favourite unit, it's not really focusing on the childcare aspect that I like, but I mean it is what it is, it's got to be done. Um, but it wasn't exactly difficult, it was just like filling out questions and researching employment law, which wasn't too bad. a quick update I guess but um so I haven't really done any more reading but um so I've been working on my coursework for I don't know like ages like an hour or so oh and I've ordered a new charger for my camera so hopefully that'll arrive soon and then I can you know sort this mess out I think I'm gonna have dinner soon and then after that I can just snuggle up for my book um, I did read a little bit of Stardust before I did studying and I don't think I read much, like I think I ended up getting distracted by Instagram. <laughs> I decided I'd make a post about saying I was going to do some reading and then I ended up not reading much <laughs> and just scrolling through Instagram. Not even scrolling through it I don't think. I don't even know what I was doing on Instagram. It's just avoiding reading <laughs> oh well so yeah I just want to say I've done some of my studying for today and I'm gonna spend some of the evening reading I'll try and sign in later but also like I kind of want to edit this before tomorrow I think this is gonna be like really difficult to edit but uh, maybe not I hope not <laughs> right I might check in before I go to bed but if not I've done reading so it is now Monday night, um, nearly 8 o'clock on Monday night, and I'm just closing up the vlog now. So I didn't do any more reading after I signed off yesterday, because I just, that's the kind of person I am. But this morning, um, 
before I left for work I read a few pages of Snow Dust, like not many, but like two. And then on the train on the way to work today I was listening to some of Gone Girl, so that must have been for about an hour maybe. And then and then on the way home I was reading The Girl Who Drank the Moon. I don't think I read very much for that, I had like probably like 15-20 pages. Um, but I was reading that on my Kindle app. So in total I didn't do very much reading this weekend, which is fine, like, it happens. This was kind of just like a practice for a, for a blog. Like, let myself in gently to vlogging. But yeah, um, I enjoyed the books I read this weekend. Yeah, I finished a graphic novel. I read a little bit of Stardust. I got through... A couple of hours of Gone Girl on Friday and today and I read a little bit of The Girl Who Drank the Moon today and Friday. So yeah, I've done a bit, I've done enough. I don't I don't feel too much pressure for not reaching certain goals over the weekend, so I'm just trying to you know, not overwhelm myself when I've got coursework and everything and I'm working a full time job as well, so you know. It is what it is, and I enjoyed my reading, so that's the most important thing. So I'm going to sign off now. I might try doing another vlog in a few weeks, but until then, I will see you soon. <laughs> I was going to, I was going to do Reagan's I'll see you soon with another video soon. <laughs> right, I will see you guys soon, and, and comment down below if you've read anything really good this weekend, and... Yeah, let me know what you're reading.